Hi, my name is Gordon from Gimeo, and today I'm going to show you how to add a hyperlink to your email signature. Firstly, you'd want to have your email signature in a HTML file like so. I've actually got my signature from Gimeo uh, website, uh, which is this one here. Um, and I'll show you how to actually put a hyperlink onto this part here manually. And I'll actually show you the um, how to add a click to call link for the phone number as well. You can quite easily add a link to your email signature in Gimeo. Um, all you have to do is just uh, expand this and then put in your address and that's it. Yeah, link has been added to your field. You can also click on any other field and add a, any other hyperlink. So basically any text field has a hyperlink option. But the point of this video is to show you how to do it manually. So we'll go back to our HTML file. Firstly, we'll open this signature up in Chrome. So what we want to add a link to is this part here, which you can see it's not clickable right now. So we'll copy that, okay, and then just minimize it. And then what you want to do is open this HTML file in a good text editor, such as Sublime Text. Okay, and you'll see um, that it color coordinates um, everything, which makes it a lot easier to read through it. Now, next, uh, do a control F to find and then paste in your bit of text. And you can see here that it's found it right there. Um, now, uh, add to add a link into here, it's actually quite straightforward. Um, all you need to do is open, do a uh, put your cursor. Uh, in front of the www part right there and then put in a open square bracket and then an a and then a space href like that equals and then inverted commas and then you just put in the address um, I'll put everything in actually and then I'll explain what it all means Okay, and then just end it there. So what this here means is this a uh, tag basically means to insert a link into this bit of text here. So you can see the opening a tag here and then some parameters and then the closing a tag there. So what this href part means is this is the reference uh, where you want uh, to go to when you click this bit of text here. So I'm saying that I want to make this bit of text here hyperlinked and when someone clicks on it I want them to go to this address here okay so I'll just quickly save that um, like so and we'll go back into Chrome into our signature because I've already got it loaded I'll just do a refresh and you can see here it's become a hyperlink now so if I click on that now it should take us to our uh, home page which it has Okay, I'll just go back to it and I'll just show you a couple of other little um, things you can do as well. Um, you can, for example, also add in a tell uh, attribute, which what that does is it makes it so when someone on a mobile phone clicks on your number, it will automatically take them to their dialer, which will, um, they'll be given the option to call your phone number very quickly instead of copying it to their dialer and then pasting it. Uh, and then calling it'll be a lot easier for them to just click on your phone number there and then add it to their uh, sorry and then um, call your mobile number so once again we'll copy this we'll do a control F to find and we can see that it's right there okay uh, it's the same thing basically we're just adding an a href um, and I'll just close it off to make it easier to see like so uh, in the href part here what we want to do for this is instead of putting HTTP or HTTPS we want to put in tell colon and then your phone number with the um, country code so I might just actually copy that from here like so uh, and now so what we're saying is when someone clicks on this it'll run this protocol here which is tell and it will automatically dial the number from your uh, phone so once again we'll save that and we'll go back into Chrome and do a refresh and you can see here it's made it a hyperlink as well you can actually do the same thing for email fields so let's say that this is an email field that says uh, greg at 
Gimmeo, the way you do it is like this. So mail to and then greg at Gimmeo, like so. So now if we save that and we go into our signature again, you can see greg at Gimmeo. But down the bottom left, you can see that it says mail to greg.gimmeo. So if, uh, if I was to click that now, uh, it will open up a new message in my Outlook. Um, so that makes it a lot easier uh, when people want to reach you, they just click on that. Okay, um, and that's all for today.